Okay, so I've also bought a new Sonos Beam. Sonos Beam that I will use both as a music hi-fi system and as a soundbar to the TV you see in the video. So here in the living room we will have the Sonos Beam set up to this TV. So let's unbox it. Very hard to unbox. I don't like this. We do it the hard way. I didn't understand the packaging. But there we go. Here we have a solar system. box when you get it open. Here we have some uh, cables. Power adapter and uh, HDMI cable and optical uh, adapter if you don't have an HDMI and we'll use optical instead. And here we have the Sonos itself and here we have some uh, documentations and so on. Download the app and everything that, that you should do to get this working. I think that's it. Or is it more in this box? So that's it. Now we have the Sonos itself here in this package. Hope you hear me. I don't have a mic for this unboxing. Hmm. Just be a bit careful here. Hold on. I didn't, I didn't like this packaging because it was very hard to unbox. Like that. white version because it should match the Google Wi-Fi and uh, a Sonos 
one system that I will buy later on. So here is the white version. Looks nice. Don't you think? There it is. So now I will set this up and we will test it on the video. Okay. Okay, so I have now set up the Sonos Beam, as you can hear. Uh, the only trouble I have is that I don't have a notification of the volume level. I don't like that. But otherwise, everything works great. I really love this Sonos Beam. The next Sonos speaker I will buy is the Sonos One Generation 2 for the kitchen. But okay, this was uh, what I have for the Sunos Beam. Okay, bye.